Just five kilometers of water separate the Cagarras archipelago from the shores of Rio de Janeiro and faint Ipanema Beach. Being so close to Brazil's second largest city, it's a miracle that these six uninhabited islands have remained a beacon of hope for biodiversity. Now this pride example of ecosystem resistance is part of Mission Blue, an alliance of more than 200 conservation groups whose aim is to protect the Earth's oceans. Being a hope spot for Mission Blue, it's an important recognition, international recognition, to create awareness in the people from Rio de Janeiro and from around the world, because it's, everything is interconnected. So we have to protect the ocean. There is one ocean and we are part of it. The islands are home to one of the largest nesting grounds of the South Atlantic for these magnificent seabirds. Some 7,500 are left in this reproductive colony. In addition, six species of marine mammals inhabit the island's neighboring waters at different times of the year, including humpback whales. The island's rocky shores are also a feeding ground for several turtles and other rare animals, some of them newly discovered. The Cagarras is a marine protected area, but this insular paradise still faces a serious risk. Rio's population of almost 7 million people and their waste. Huge amounts of plastic and other waste are constantly washing up on the island's shores and the sewage undersea pipeline also impacts the quality of the water. 70% of the Earth's surface is covered by the ocean, and it is where life, as we know it, was born. And it is vital for climate regulation, so we need to preserve it. Being nominated a hope spot, a special place critical to the health of the ocean, is more than a title. For these islands and for Rio, it means real hope for a better and sustainable future. Lucrecia Franco, CGTN, Rio de Janeiro.